Hi guys, this is Raina with nonbiasedreviews.com. Today I have a new gadget and I cannot wait to share my experience with you uh, regarding this tool. So this is really cool. It goes on your bed, of course. It's called the Chili Pad. Um, you can go anywhere between 110 degrees if you're too hot and then 55 degrees. Um, it's a dual zone, so you can set it up to either adjust it. You like to sleep cool, you can adjust to your uh, settings or whichever temperature you prefer to sleep on. You cannot go wrong with this. It's not just one pad with one temperature set. So let's see how it's going to work. Now actually this is the box. It comes in this box, it's, it's a cube um, chili pad. Um, this is really exciting. I love technology and hopefully this is going to do the job. Um, right now I am filming this all by myself. Usually I have someone assisting me, but I told them to leave the room. Why? Because later on, once I set this up and put it on my bed, I'm going to play around with the temperature and see if it's actually working and call each and every one of my family members to lay on their bed and uh, just film their reaction. I'm not going to say anything at all. I'm just going to have them lay down, set up the temperature. I will show you the temperature and what I did and then we'll see the reaction and see how it's working. Let's unbox this pad and see how it works. All right, so we have here the name of it. It's called Chili Pad Cube. Um, I can tell that this is a the cover or the topper that goes on top of your mattress and it fits any mattress, whether it's thick or thin. So, that's what's in the box first of all. Just want to feel it. Feels very good. I can feel wires. Yeah. This is something you need to have built in to adjust the temperature. So I'm going to make my bed in a second. So this is the first bang. Alright, now it's here inside the box, it's here, no more sweating, tossing and turning. Only sleeping well. So, we are about to find out if that's true or not, I guess, once we put it to the test. Alright you guys, huh. this is very important. The uh, the manual <laughs> we have. Usually, I'm not a big manual fan. I just wing it. <laughs> I know I shouldn't, but this time with all the stuff that come inside the box, I must read the steps and follow the manual. I guess. Yeah. All right. Manual. Some gloves. A remote control. Oh, cool. Here you have the buttons for chill or hot, cold or hot. All right. We got some stuff going on. And here's the cube. That's where everything happens. I know I said I'm going to read the manual. I will, I promise. But I'm just thinking, because I'm allowed to think, that this is where the um, tubes or hoses go in, because there's hoses here. And then, let's just follow the steps. So, chili technology. Unit must be filled with water before use. Um, all right. So I've got some work to do. I'm gonna fill it with water. Okay, so this is box number one. And box number two. 
So we got two of those. Two cubes, one for each. There you go, for the dual zone, dual zone to work. Of course, you have to have one for each. Sleeper. It does say on the box, your great sleep at the touch of a button. Thanks to the wireless remote. Alrighty. Control your temperature in exact increments. Heat to 110 degrees, cools to 55 degrees. Now, I did think right away, I'm like, ah, oh, why do I even need this? I live in Arizona. But guess what? I know it's January and it feels like 80 degrees right now outside. Almost mid 80s, but not quite there. But anyway. It will get hot in the summertime if it's not cold in the winter yet. <laughs> it gets hot in the summertime, and this is when I personally actually need it. So, yay. all right, so two boxes one for each sleeper or two cubes. Um, we're going to follow the instructions in the manual. This is not something I can just play around with and guess and figure out whether I'm right or wrong. This is something that has instructions that we certainly need to follow. All right. And like I said, I'm going to call my family members one at a time, from husband to kids. Yes, they're going to be my guinea pigs. <laughs> well, actually, it's all for, you know, um, you guys to see whether it's working or not. So, we're going to film the reaction. You sleep hot, you sleep cool, it doesn't matter. You can sleep hot or cool and use this. So, use a clean washable pad, energy efficient design, two year warranty, and highly addictive for great sleep. We'll find out. Now, most importantly, we want to see and find out if this device, oh, the cube, it is a little heavy, um, whether it's um, loud or not. So, all right, let's get to work. So I don't know if you can hear it, guys. That's the cube running right now. It's on. And we are going to find out tonight whether it's going to be too loud or how it's going to be as we uh, sleep at night. Like now my mattress is wearing the pad. I can feel um, inside this pad tiny little tubes going on. Definitely, they're there. All right. Let's see if we can go. Sitting on it. Feels good. Well, what's most important is laying down on it and waking up next morning. How is it going to feel? So, you can make it all hot, all cold, or half half. Dual zone is what it's called. All right, so before we get started, keep the cube away from areas that might become dry and wet, such as an open window, so rain, you know. Okay, so what do we have inside each box, or inside that big box here? I have the cube, but I have two cubes in this case because there's two sleepers, one for each, the pad that's on my mattress right now, the remote, so I have two remotes, and drain key, which is this one. All right, here we go. Using the cube, first of all, how you use the cube, it tells you exactly air intake vent, water reservoir cap, power cord, tubing connection. I'm gonna follow the steps, like I said, and make sure that. This is all set up correctly. We don't want to go wrong with this one. This is not a toy. 
and set up, start fold and place it flat on top of your waterproof mattress protector, which is on top of your mattress. Tail tube is connected to the pad. Set position elastic underneath the mattress to keep the chili pad in place. That's why you have those elastic bands or straps. Place your fitted sheet directly over the chili pad. So this goes first, and then the fitted sheet on top, which is what I'm going to do right now. See, this is what I was wondering because you can feel the little tubes inside the chili pad. Uh, it is advisable here that you use a um, mattress cover or fitted sheet that is a little thick, thicker than usual, so you don't feel these um, tubes inside the pad as you lay down. So you're going to be sleeping for hours at night. You don't want to wake up feeling anything, you know, uncomfortable. Alright, connect the chili pad. All the Okay. That is warm under here. And what do you feel? Is it warm or cold? Warm. It's warm? Yeah. Alright, go to the other side. Okay. Go to that side. But go under. Yeah, but go under and then tell me if you feel warm or cold. It's warm. It's warm? Romy? Yeah. Is it warm where you're sitting right now? Yeah. How about the other side, on mommy's side? I did! Try it again. How does it feel like? The other side. Sleep on the other pillow. There you go. How does it feel? Fast. How does it feel? And, and one. And tell me how you feel. Ray doesn't know what's going on, what's happening. We're going to ask him a question. Lay down. And how does it feel on your body? Lay down. Put your head on the pillow. It feels warm, fluffy. Does it feel warm when you're yeah. sleeping right now? Your back. How does your back feel? Do you feel my anything? My back doesn't feel anything, but my legs definitely do. Do you feel what? Like a heater. A heater? Some sort. Something hot or cold? Hot. Can you go on the other pillow and lay down? There you go, as if you sleep on that side, there you go. And think about it, how does it feel now? This feels very fluffy. And how about your back and your legs? Really cold. Really cold? Yeah. So it's really cold on the left side of the back, and it's really warm on the right side of the back, correct? Yes. Okay, thank you. Hi guys. So this is normally my side of the bed, the left side of the bed. Uh, this is where I sleep on. It is on cold right now. It's 60 degrees. You can definitely feel that it's cold. I can feel something running or going on under uh, my body. <laughs> uh, you have to have a fitted sheet over this chili pad, definitely. It's a must. So the chili pad sits on top of a mattress cover and then, so between mattress cover and a fitted sheet. That's rule number one. Number two, I do have a remote for my rise bed, but then I have two other remotes. So <laughs> if you're like me and you have an adjustable bed, uh, you need to figure out which is which. Um, and then one very important thing. I don't know if you can hear the noise on one of the cubes or both cubes. Right now they're both running simultaneously. I don't know if you can hear it. I do run diffusers in this house. I do run humidifiers for my kids in their bedrooms. It's almost the same um, noise or sounds like white noise kind of. Uh, we'll see if we're going to fall asleep and... Uh, just make sure that this doesn't doesn't bother me or uh, you know I'm not distracted by this noise it's gonna wake me up uh, by the way I'm talking now and I still can feel the cold like there's something cold running or like a little teeny river inside those little tubes under my body and I do not like the cold weather I'm gonna go to the other side and see what's going on this is 60 degrees this one is supposed to be 
corner, it's 110, and I know exactly what it feels like, how it feels like when it's 110, because I live in Arizona, it's sometimes 113 degrees, so. Alright, let's move to the other side. <laughs> oh, yes! Yes, I, I was not acting up, that was awesome. You know how it feels like when you jump in the pool and it's super cold? That's exactly what it feels like right now, okay? Imagine that. I jumped in the pool, it's really, really cold, cold water, and then you have the hot tub. So you moved from the cold pool to the hot tub. That's exactly how it feels like right now. Okay, which tells me that this is definitely working. The only thing I worry about is the noise, like I said. The maintenance the cleaning of the cubes probably, so that's why we need to read the instructions. We have to fill them with water every three months. You know, all those things we need to uh, follow the manual step by step to make sure that we're doing the right thing to maintain this chili pad and the cubes and the tubes and everything that comes with. So, here's what we're gonna do. We're going to sleep tonight using now. I'm, I don't know if I really want to sleep on cold, but I'm afraid I might wake up and I'm blue and I'm dead, but we'll see what happens. That's, that's my thought. Let's hope I don't die overnight. Because, oh my goodness, it really feels warm. I think I'm going to sleep on this side. <laughs> and that as an other person sleeps on the other side. Hold on, let me make sure that that's my easy breather. Uh, there you go. That's my side officially now. I got my easy breather. I got my tomorrow comforter and it's nice and warm. I don't want to be on the cold side. But I'm telling you right now, it's really reworking. It's definitely working. I love it. I love the dual zone. Yes. This is something awesome. Um, yep. Yeah, let's just see what happens. <laughs>